Hello everyone, this is me Sadia here and I'm doing your uh, third week of August reading starting from the 18th, uh, sorry, 15th through the uh, 21st of August 2019. This is going to be for the sign of Sagittarius, so let's see what's coming up for Sagittarians for this week. Um, since I accidentally said uh, 18 instead of 15, so maybe you are going to receive these energies coming in your life uh, from 18th through the 21st of August. So pick however it resonates in you, uh, in your life, uh, in your particular situation. You can always get a uh, personal reading um, for the situation that you are dealing with in your life. Uh, you can you know, just reach out to me for that on my email ID in the description box. So let's get get into the reading and let's see what's coming up for the sign of Sagittarius for this week, which is which has already started today. So let's see what's coming up for Sagittarius for this week. What's coming up for you? What's coming up for you? The Magician, The Fool, Five of Swords, wow, Four of Swords, perfect. Underneath the deck you do have Ace of Cups, underneath that the World, wow, underneath that Five of Wands, underneath that King of Pentacles. Uh, um, it's, it's, um, let's see one more card, huh? Nine of Wands, okay. Um. I'm picking up like, you know, you are going to kind of, you know, rushing towards the best thing in your life. Like, you know, everything is going so smooth, so quick and fast. Everything is moving in the right direction for you right now in your life. Um, but when it comes to the person that you are dealing with, I do see delays in their life. I do see your path is very clear, but the path of the person that you are dealing with is, is you know, there are some sort of hindrances in their path something that blocks them something that stops them from you know achieving what they want but when it comes to you know if i talk about just you or your energy everything seems to be perfect al perfectly aligned with what you truly desire you are going to get emotionally fulfilled you are going to feel like a magician where you know how to control the things that you want to control in your life and how to let go of the things that you want to let go of and uh, it's, it's more like you know you have you know, whatever you are now, whatever you are going to feel during this third week of August, it's going to happen because, um, because of the hard work that you've put in, in uh, put into it, and um, it didn't come to you naturally. I would say because I do see a hard work behind that. I do see, um, you you've been hurt. You've been having the times when you were thinking about you know how to make things work, but you managed to control the stress that you were having around it and now you have you know you, your path is clear whatever you want is right there um you are on the right path which is going to lead you towards your desires dreams and goals whatever was blocking you you have already overcome that whatever was you know um could have been the reason to stop you from you know uh leading towards your path has kind of you know you know it be that a blessing that you know you you are going to feel or be that your your um your hard work which is going to make you win each and every situation in your life and um you are definitely going to feel very empowered by whatever you are doing in your life um be that on a smaller scale be that on a larger scale but i do see you know um big changes happening for you during this week time you are going to feel um emotionally fulfilled perfect in each and every way is what i'm picking up very strongly but again like i said there is this you know um there is something wrong with the person that you are dealing with you know um okay let's see one more card and i believe you know whoever you are dealing with you, you know your life is perfect you are doing the best you can do in you know in your life but when it comes to you thinking of the person that you are dealing with there there are certain issues there they they or their energy makes you feel stressed at times is what i'm picking up it's going to happen for you during this week time because your life is going to go so smooth that when you look at them you would feel bad for them is what i'm picking up um they are going to be juggling with uh you know stability i believe um they are you know not putting in the effort that they need to put into it to make things work it's like you know they are being wishy-washy and they are not you know ready to um to make the effort like you did 
it's like you know they they are just you know waiting and you know doing nothing and just hoping and wishing that things will work out but to be uh, to be where you are right now you have put in a lot of effort so they really need to understand that you know um Let's see some more cards uh, for that person's energy because I don't see like, you know, um, I don't see that, I don't see that there is anything missing in your life. But when you think of this person, whoever it is, the, you know, it, it's make, it's, it's more like, you know, thinking of this person is going to make you feel stressed. Maybe because they are, you know, very non-serious towards what they are doing in their life, uh, financially or career-wise, because uh, that's where the whole thing is coming from. So let's see who this person is and why their energy is bothering you. Because I do see your energy is so pure, positive and pure. And this person that you're dealing with is, you know, having some negativity around them. Let's see what is wrong with this person that you are dealing with. The energies could be worse for some of you. Maybe you are the one who is dealing with issues. And the person that you are dealing with is, you know, perfectly doing well in their life. So pick however it resonates with you in your particular situation. What's wrong with this person? What's wrong with this person? Why? They are not doing their food. They really want to, you know, put in the effort, but I'm picking up, you know, this person is basically relying on you more than their own success is what I'm picking up very strongly. Like, you know, whoever this person is, um, they are basically, you know, they might not be financially well and they would be looking, looking towards you for you know helping them in their in their whatever they are doing in their career you know zone um they see you as your strength so it doesn't have to be financial help it could be just that you know you make them feel strong but there is lack of either passion there is lack of either you know um the dedication that you that you had which made you have what you have right now in your life but when it comes to this person this person lacks the strength this person lacks the motivation that you had so it's it's not that they don't want to come out of it they do but there is something wrong with their um with the way they are perceiving things i believe you know that's what i'm picking up with this person's energy um let's see one more card They really want to see you successful. And they it's as well like, you know, this person is ready to enjoy your success. But when it comes to putting in the effort for themselves, they are not going to do that as well. I'm picking up very strongly. It's like, you know, this person is going to be, you know, this person is maybe somebody who is not, um, you know, somebody who is not ready to put in effort into, you know, making things better. But when it comes to you, you do have that passion to kind of, you know, raise your, uh, level of uh, you know um, living or standard of your living and this person is okay with whatever they are having right now in their life and that's why it's it's more like you know they seek happiness in your success is what I'm picking up for for different people it would be different the reasons could be like different maybe you have the opportunities this person doesn't have maybe you know there is something which they lack and you do have that um, but they do see you as a, as an empowering person in their life and somebody who gives them the strength. But I do see that, you know, I don't see that this person needs money from you. But uh, for some of you, like very few of you, maybe this person is going to ask uh, financial help from you. Um, let's see. You, you know, when, when it comes to your love life, I believe there are going to be, you know, because because if this person is, you know, somebody you are romantically attracted to 
or rom- uh, romantically involved with uh, or in a relationship with as well whoever this person is they are going to um it's, it's more like you know your energies around every area of your life is perfectly positive but this person is bringing you some negativity in your life it's how you manage to deal with it during this week time is going to be the uh you know the the test of time for you i believe because this you know it's it's more like you know at times you might feel like you know leaving this person behind at times you would feel like fighting it w- with them um but whatever is happening is happening for a reason you you might not get to know the reason right now because the universe has a bigger plan for you but you soon will know what is it happening for uh why things are not moving on with this person something is going to come to light when the time is right something that is not known to both of you right now but you soon will when the time is right so yeah that's pretty much it coming up for you for this week if the reading resonates with you to like subscribe and share if you're willing to get a personal reading you can always reach out to me for that on my email id in the description box till i do the next reading for you people take care bye bye